This is a demonstration of how to use the recalibrate feature to migrate your existing EM curve to a new M2.0 model calibration. We'll also cover recalibrating an existing M2.0 model calibration. Here are some things to do to prepare for your M2.0 calibration. Do a slope and motion calibration. Do both a plot weight and test weight load cell calibration. You'll need a minimum of two samples with a known moisture. One sample, closest to the industry moisture standard, with a known test weight. The more samples you have, the better. You'll need at least a 3% moisture spread from lowest moisture to highest moisture. The more samples you have within about a 10% range, the better. But two or three samples will suffice. Each sample should weigh at least 6 pounds, and the samples need to be at ambient temperature. The samples do need to have a natural moisture content, no re-wetting of samples. If you are unsure about your test weight volume calibration, perform a test weight recalibration. To do this, select the calibration you would like to edit and select the pencil icon. From here, tap the gear icon and ensure that the insert count reflects what is currently in the test weight chamber of the H2. Once you have done that, press the recalibrate button in the bottom left corner of the screen. Tap test weight adjust and select the green arrow to proceed. To adjust the test weight, we only need one sample. Enter the known test weight and dump the sample through three times. Press the button to proceed. The change settings are now shown. If you're happy with the changes, press the check to finish the calibration. Now we will add an M2.0 model calibration to an existing EM curve. Once you're connected to the H2 grain gauge, go to Setup, H2 grain gauge, Moisture Curves, and select which EM curve you would like to add the M2.0 calibration to. Once the curve is highlighted, select the pencil icon to edit. From this screen, select the gear on the right hand side and scroll to the bottom of the settings. Use the drop down within the H2 Moisture 2.0 grain model box to select the grain type. Once the grain type is selected, hit the recalibrate button in the bottom left of the screen. A prompt will appear to save the changes. Select Save. The recalibrate menu will then be shown. Select the H2 Moisture 2.0 model adjust and click the green arrow to proceed. Now we can begin dumping samples. Be prepared to catch each sample, as we recommend cycling each sample three to five times. Enter the known moisture of your first sample, dump it into the grain gauge, and press the cycle button. The last value button can be used to restore the moisture entry from the previous moisture sample. You can cycle as many samples as desired, the more the better. From the lowest moisture sample to the highest moisture sample, there must be at least a 3% range, but a range closer to 10% is preferred. Once you have dumped all the samples you have available, press the green arrow to proceed to the next step. This screen shows the values calculated as a result of your new calibration. In addition to the settings you've seen in the past, notice the offset value at the bottom of the screen. The offset is a value that shifts our existing model to match your benchtop standard. Different grains at different moistures have a range of acceptable offsets, so if any offset number is present, the M2.0 model has been calibrated successfully. Once you have verified that an M2.0 offset is present, Hit the green check in the bottom right to finish the calibration. This screen shows your previously existing EM curve. The M2.0 offset is saved in the settings of the calibration. From this screen, you can dump samples through the grain gauge and cycle them using this yellow cycle button in the bottom left corner. Once the grain is cycled, readings will be displayed in this window. Notice that the M2.0 and EM data are displayed side by side. However, when using this calibration in Harvest, only your M2.0 data will be displayed by default. Traditional EM data can be exported using the Advanced Export option. 
When you are ready to save the calibration, press the green check in the bottom right. An existing M2.0 model can also be recalibrated. From the moisture curve screen, highlight an existing M2.0 calibration and tap the pencil icon to edit. Select the recalibrate button in the bottom left of the screen. Within the recalibrate menu, select the H2 Moisture 2.0 model adjust on the bottom. Press the green arrow to continue. Now, samples can be cycled to adjust the model, as seen in the previous steps of this video. When you have cycled all of the samples you have available, finish the calibration and save by hitting the green check on the bottom right of the graph screen. If you have any questions or concerns, please contact HarvestMaster.